so the skipping rope is a jumping exercise that I often used in the final stage of a rehab program. Um, often with um, an ankle injury uh, or, or even with knee injuries or lower limb injuries. So it's kind of really important to get that um, spring back in the jump and that's what we're going to start with today. So we're just going to do a couple of exercises. The first few are going to be running um, over the like side to side over the, over the rope and then we'll start with some jumping. Always we start with double leg and then progress to single leg. So if you can't do a single leg jump, then just start with the double. And yeah, these are really great for uh, runners and trail runners, uh, especially trail runners when you are to like perhaps jump from an obstacle to another obstacle. So it gets that little bit of agility and and kind of leg speed. So go with it and give it a try. So from here, I'm just going to start with running side to side over the over the over the rope. hugging the bush a bit. Alright. Now we're going to jump forwards and back. Okay. And then side to side. So those were all double leg exercises and just that I can feel it gets my heart rate up. So it's quite a nice workout. So if you're struggling with the frustration of skipping, just adding that in will be a good workout. Alright, so the next ones we're gonna do are we're gonna do single leg, see how you go. Also when you're doing single leg, what's quite nice is to compare how you are side to side. Alright, so a nice little variation there. That was forward and back, now we're going to do side to side. So you can see for me, my left foot is not as good and um, I've struggled with an Achilles injury for probably on and off a year so I know my jumping is not good on that side so it's really great because I can feel that difference show up. So see how you go, be aware of side to side differences. Also if you have an existing injury such as an Achilles injury or an ankle injury just be aware of how that jumping does affect it definitely in the kiddies we don't want to be doing this every day so probably want to aim to do it twice a week but don't let anything flare up 
have fun with the exercises and see how you go and post and let us know. Cheers.